Hey guys, welcome back one more time to the Breckenridge Distillery here off Airport Road in Breckenridge. And I'm Andy and I've got my co-host here, Jesse, with us, who also happens to deal with marketing for the Breckenridge Distillery as well. Now, if you've joined us earlier in the show, we've been making our way through the facility here and we are currently hanging out on the awesome back patio. We've been distracted by the games here. And you, I mean, aside from the, the drinks, aside from that, you guys have this gorgeous space where you can hang out and there's uh, lunch now available too. Yeah. So last summer we launched uh, we launched lunch for the first time and we do a Kansas City style barbecue and we serve it right out of our food truck so people can come in order at the bar and then come hang out on the patio grab a cocktail play bags cornhole we have ring toss over there which my office is right there and it's so fun <laughs> watching people like actually get the ring toss and be like Woo! Cheering add some excitement window. to my day but anyway um yeah so you can grab lunch and then we have the handcrafted cocktails that are available all day and then as we move into later in the afternoon we have happy hour four to six so those are buy one get one free on our well drinks and well is just our normal bourbon vodka gin and rum and things like that and carrying on into the dinner time frame, you have the fabulous dinner menu by Chef David Burke. That's the kind of a, I put that together for you guys. Yeah, it is so delicious. And it actually has plenty of options for gluten-free, vegetarian, and then it has some kind of off the wall items. So it's not just your typical um, burger and steak. So we have a lot of options. We call it modern American uh, with altitude. Yeah, okay. um, so yeah, he comes in and he designs our menu. Um, we have a great staff who's always kind of switching things up for those daily specials so we always have a variety and i like that on the menu too like you're explaining you know there's like those things that you would think of as like traditional comfort foods like you got the chicken and pasta but then it's really so unique yeah absolutely one of the coolest dishes i think on the menu is our um uh, ribeye. It's a porterhouse ribeye that's dry aged for 40 days in a Himalayan sea salt room. Wow. It is a trademark of Chef David Burke. And then he also has his DB burger, which you can find at a lot of his restaurants um, across the country. And so what we try to do here is really focus on local and seasonal mm -hmm. um, ingredients and cuisine. So always switching things up as the seasons roll through. So something always unique to experience when you come here to the Breckenridge Distillery, whether it be for lunch or dinner or possibly for a tour. Yeah, tours, <laughs> uh, buying some swag and some bottles from our um, retail shop or just coming out to honestly like have a sweet adventure out on the mountain or mountain biking, come back and sit on our patio or on the little lounge area and just grab a cocktail and just cool off. It's it's really such a cool experience here. And uh, we also have our location on Main Street. Mm -hmm. So if you're just cruising around town and you don't have time to come out here, you can swing by there and get a couple free tastings there as well as upgrade to some of our higher end. And there's tons of really fun swag there as well. And I love with, you know, coming over to the location here with the cocktail menu you guys offer, it really provides like a, a interesting way to experience the different types of liqueurs and, you know, in ways that you maybe wouldn't make a beverage at home. Yeah, I always get caught up sitting at the bar and just <laughs> watching our bartenders craft these drinks. I mean, it is really interesting to see how much passion and creativity they put into each cocktail. And you actually can learn something. So we have cocktail cards um, in the retail shop. So if you buy a bottle of rum or vodka or gin, um, take one of those cocktail cards home and then you can kind of elevate your experience at home and make some really cool drinks like an old fashioned or um, you know some of those prohibition style drinks that I would never know how to make <laughs> until I sit here and watch them. <laughs> We'll stop on over here to the Breckenridge Distillery and a reminder of where we're at here on Airport Road. Yeah, so right now at 1925 Airport Road, just north of Breckenridge. And then we also have our Main Street location at 137 um, South Main Street, right in the Blue River Plaza. Awesome. Well, thanks so much for having us here this week. Yep. Thank you for stopping by. <laughs> well, come on over, you guys. Lunch will be kicking off here in a couple hours, or you could stop in later on for dinner. And then they offer tours daily. So come on over to the Breckenridge Distillery and experience some of the delicious food and cocktails that they have to offer. We're going to probably get to some yard games here in a minute, so we're going to send things back to the studio. So that is it for us over here in Breck. But I will see you guys next week, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, live for Summit Sunrise.